Currently, the energy team is working on the housing authority of the city of Asheville. There are seven different developments totaling about 1,200 individual apartments that we are doing weatherization services on. Uh, those services may include everything from air sealing a door to actually getting in the attics and weatherizing or air sealing the, uh, the holes and, and gaps that are in attics, crawl spaces, walls, um, and also installing insulation in a few, a few of the units as well. And can you tell me a little bit about the weatherization and energy arms of Green Opportunities, what they're about and when they started? Yes. The, as far as the actual uh, parts of the organization that do weatherization or building performance services, uh, we have one which is the Weatherization Assistance Crew, which has partnered with the, the Community Action Opportunities Organization here in our area. And we were doing a number of uh, homes, residential homes, low income in the what we call the Weed and Seed District in a certain part of town. Um, the energy team part that I actually am operating is more of a, a private sector energy team where we're going out and doing uh, residential and commercial building performance work in the uh, mainly the Asheville metro area. Can you tell me a little bit more about the private sector energy team that you work with and how that got started and what the process is for getting involved with that? Certainly. As the Green Opportunities started to grow, we realized that there was, A, uh, the potential for a lot of building performance work in, in our area and, and really across the nation, and B, it was a great way for to get individuals that we had trained into jobs right away so they could get on-the-job experience. Uh, I was hired, actually, because the Housing Authority of the City of Asheville had shown interest in starting this project um, and shown interest in having Green Opportunities be a part of the project. Um, the actual contract went to Siemens of North America, who then uh, inevitably hired us to complete the air sealing work where we're stopping air infiltration into the buildings. Um, since uh, I've come on board, we've been working in that project about four months and are getting near the end. We have about a month to go, and we are now ramping up and doing marketing for the private sector uh, and really trying to focus on commercial work where we're getting into commercial buildings, everything from industry, offices, institutional, and uh, showing them the, the opportunities doing energy audits and showing them the opportunities for improvement of their building shell. And what's your favorite part about working for Green Opportunity? My favorite part is actually uh, just seeing the, the individuals that we have coming through our organization, uh, getting trained, understanding building science, and getting out there and, and doing it and, and doing it quite well. Um, individuals that haven't had a job for a long time or have had some form of barrier to employment, it, it can get you down. And they when I, they first come on board, they, they tend to have, uh, you know, they they're sad, they have financial issues, they just aren't, aren't having a good time, basically. And then as they start working and receiving a paycheck, a regular paycheck, but also start learning more about this profession that's out there, uh, they start uh, just being more comfortable financially and seeing that there is a career path for them. Um, and we actually have two individuals right now that are, we're in the midst of planning with them for, to open their own businesses where they're going to be doing certain aspects of this industry, which is really exciting.